Hi guys, how are you today? Today, I just want to talk about how to choose wisely. Because guys, our life having a fibromyalgia, it's not easy. Sometimes, because of our frustration, we just decide, choose right away without thinking because of our frustration. And sometimes we just easily said, I don't have a choice. That's the first thing we can say right out from our mouth that I don't have a choice. Therefore, I do this and that. Okay, you are frustrated. You are saying that. But you really, guys, have you ever think each and every one of us have a choice what we are going to do, what we want to buy, what, to, what, what we want to eat, everything, everybody have a choice. So guys, when you're frustrated and you just say it right away, I don't have a choice. Just stop for a moment. Have a moment with yourself and think wisely. And if you like something, you want to buy a thing, just use your time to go back to the store probably two times. Don't decide that right away. Go back later. You just, you can say to the store, okay, I will get back to you later. So go a strolling in the mall and think at the same time that you are thinking with the thing you want to buy. But probably you have some other one choice much better than that or cheaper than that. So guys, always go back to the store two times, especially when it is very expensive. It's okay in the grocery if you are going to buy something, you want to eat this and that, it's okay. But if you want to buy something valuable to yourself and you probably frustrated and you need it right away, guys, use your time. Choose that thing to see, I like this thing, this is what I want, but can I go back to you later just say that, that can i go back to you later just do the time use the time so number one how to choose wisely use your time to think about it to focus be awake and think your situation on that very moment is that really you want okay be aware and guys because when we are having fibromyalgia, the pain, the dizziness, it's there every now and then. So therefore, it's just easy for us to say, I don't have a choice. I do this. No, Ed and every one of us have a choice. We have just to think wisely and think. Number two, think. You have your health to consider. So watch out your choices what you want, what you want to do, what you eat, anything, where you want to go. Choose what you want by thinking about your health that you have something to consider. And number three, guys, remember, because regardless what you choose, especially when you are making big decisions in your family, what you choose good or bad there's always somebody who is not satisfied discontentment and complaining it's just normal we are all human and it's just normal that not all people feeling contentment what you choose satisfied what you choose it's just normal normal guys so that we have to accept to so that's life that's a part of life even you are doing your best to choose wisely what you want remember there's always consequences because of the people who is complaining not satisfied discontentment and that's a part of the process 
especially if you are the one who will choose decide for everybody in your family and it's good if your family will take you as a consideration that you're having fibromyalgia you cannot do this you cannot go there and you don't like to travel there and everywhere but it's not always the case and it's also normal especially when we have a big family so guys remember always at the end of the day the most important thing is yourself respect yourself respect your feelings and the best thing you can do choose from your heart that is a matter of respecting yourself that's a matter of loving yourself so choose from the heart okay we have to think that heart and thinking always yeah there's something cannot be balanced sometimes because we are feeling we have to do our feel what we feel and sometimes we thinking another thing but think first be aware and always especially with, if you are talking with your family always speak from the heart straight from the heart and be firm because whatever your choices believe it so will so you will not regret it that's what i am doing guys if i choose something then i have to say to myself there's no regret it's done so be firm and believe that everything whatsoever your choices everything is happen for a reason honestly is the best policy being honest it's very important be honest to yourself and it's very important because you are considering yourself You're, we are having fibromyalgia and there's a lot of things to consider so think of that guys wisely think wisely and speak straight from the heart and whatsoever you have chosen, have peace with it. And yeah, that's what I've said. Believe that is that this is the right one you want. So guys, this is my share with you today because I learned a lesson for this. Last week, I bought a camera and when I reached home, I was being frustrated it's a very expensive camera for my hobby because I love photography and when I arrive home I cannot use the camera because it's so complicated it's so advanced for my label and I don't have the experience of that kind of camera so I was frustrated for two days only two days guys I admit I choose badly at that time I asked my colleagues what is the best he said that is the Canon M50 is the best I bought it it's nice it's very expensive but I like it that was my bad choice because my my knowledge is not in that camera I don't have enough intelligence yet to use that camera so i was frustrated and only two days i returned it to the store and it's good here in norway because we have 30 days buying free you can return it to the store within 30 days yes i am going to buy a camera for my hobby but not now i have to wait when i learn because there's a lot of things to learn in a camera in a computer in a cell phone the advanced technology at this moment is so complicated and i have the migraines i don't have the patience to study more so guys therefore i learned this think wisely what you want what you are going to do with that 
especially with your family, and accept yourself whatever you choice. Your family or friends, there's always somebody who is not satisfied. Just have peace with it. Speak from the heart. And believe everything is happening for a reason. I know it is not easy. Especially if it is involved with your family. But guys, that's this life. So guys, just face it. I am having difficulty with that. I am still working with myself with that. I am still in the process of learning. Even I am old already. That is just life. So guys, thank you so much for watching. Today I'm not feeling well. But I am doing this video in order to inspire me to keep going because i have the headache the whole day and i am committed to this because you are the one who give me inspiration i have to do this so i hope somebody listening there that i'm doing this why i am doing this video to have inspiration that i can still do the things i want even i am having fibromyalgia it's not easy it's hard guys but i feel good when i am finished this talking with you in this video i feel good with myself even i have the pain even i have the headache right now i feel good and it comforts me it helps me so therefore i am doing this video even though i am not feeling so well today I am trying my best to sit in the camera to keep going in order to inspire others. I hope you will do the same guys because it's hard. Today I'm smiling probably but it's hard. I'm thinking I want to do this video or not. But when my mind is set into things, I want to do that. I am sharing this with you so I hope you will keep living, doing Think wisely what you are doing, what you are doing with your family, your hobby, and everything. Just be yourself. Thank you so much, guys, for watching family and friends. I love you all. Namaste.